Previously on Life is Strange. Whoa. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now. It won't work. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Coffee, please, tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. Life is Strange est un jeu permettant aux joueurs d'influencer l'histoire. Toutes vos actions et décisions pourront avoir un impact sur le passé, présent et futur. Choisissez bien. Salut les marlous, c'est Tivileux du 12. Et sur cette belle euh, mer, quand on va commencer ce 14e épisode de Life is Strange, qui est. Bon, je, euh, je suis en avance. <rire> 14e épisode qui va commencer ce quatrième chapitre, en par ce jeu édité par Square Enix et développé par Download. Cette image de deux vélos. Je développé par le node. Il y a eu un masterclass le lundi, donc c'était le 12, sur le jeu qui était très intéressant. Je vous invite à le regarder quand le, le, la redis sera disponible. C'est du, du game créateur du jeu. Et ce quatrième, ce quatrième chapitre, ce quatrième épisode s'appelle The Dark Room. Et niveau émotion, ça va monter. Euh... C'est vraiment la partie de l'histoire du jeu la plus dure qui commence. Bon, déjà, rien qu'en voyant les... les baleines ou les cachelots, ça fait mal. Oh. Weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. 
I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. Too bad for a family. This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Do you think so? I uh, haven't kept up with the details. Why? I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. But none of this makes sense. I know things seem out of control, but... As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. None taken. C'est plus le jour. Bref, retour chez Chloé. Une maison qui est beaucoup plus finie. C'est une très high tech layer. Feels like a high tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you're here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, you know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even mm. imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Ouais, on y va.
On va prendre le de blé. On va faire un petit tour du propriétaire. That is so incredible. And she can browse cat videos on the web. Il y a d'autres choses à voir que des photos de chacun. Chloe is still a punk at heart. But she can't stage dive anymore. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. Man, Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. They're so great. Chloe's message board since the accident sure looks lonely. I didn't add much. Bad Max. I still can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. Well, That must be her mighty morphine machine. No more bongs for her. Mm. Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her water. Did I give her a choice? Drink up, Buttercup. Oh, man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. Trois jours avant. Ou quatre. Et souvenir le plus marquant. What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. Uh, yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Ça fait un peu prétentieux quand même lui de remarquer. Ok les amis, tu m'as moi. Ça fait très prétentieux quand même. Hey. Which friends did you hang out with the most? Merci. Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. She was cool. But after my accident, she was too cool for school. I know I wasn't around much. No excuses, I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. They love you so much. I know. My mom and dad are so cute. They always pop in here and make sure everything's okay with me. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks and the medical bills are fucking insane. Can they pay all the bills? <laughs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. <laughs> Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when you watch movies. I remember Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. Hey, I'm going to go to the wall. Snow globes are taking over. I have a point of view for you. Here's the DVD. 
Yeah. Alors avant. Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Hello Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. Oui, ça lui change. Oh, the snow dough. I guess not everything changed. Non. Non, de ce côté. Oh man. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. Je suis pas sûr que ce soit vraiment une bonne chose. Hein. I'm glad I took this photo. Chloe has a new memory of William and her together. Wow, sir. Chloe was a straight A student. She could have gone to any college. Gutless bastard. I am so glad Chloe stole your bullshit fund. Even if it wasn't another reality. Je vais respire. Despite everything, they're still a happy family again. It's cool that in this reality, Chloe really loves skating too. Max, it is so cool that you're here again. I'm glad. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? She can't even feel the grass now. That's a serious heat lamp. DVD power. Ça c'est le genre de nuit bien chiante. Tu te fais mal un peu partout. I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you? I know you were beat down after the day with me, and Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do, you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. You are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Yesterday was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe.
Allez, on va en faire un petit tour. Ils ont donné Chloe leur grand, expensive HDTV. Et ils utilisent notre chute tube télévision. Alors, je vais se lire. Dark room. Oh, elle pas d'émoji, Chloé. Tu nous as fichu avec ça pendant tout euh, l'autre réalité. Pas pour que tu t'en remettes. Oh. Enfin bref. Donc, euh, voilà. Je vous laisse regarder la page du journal intime. Il n'y en a qu'une seule. Hein Alors, euh, bah, on va utiliser le, le choix de la sociabilité. Normalement, je serais bien tenté de parler avec euh, William, mais finalement, on va pas parler. They might get their own home taken away because of medical bills. That's terrible. C'est là que tu dis que le système américain est vraiment pourri. These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? Jesus. Rachel Amber is even missing in this reality. I guess I can't change everything. Je vais essayer de me mettre sur pause. Dans un temps normal, je vais Je vais parler avec euh, William. No change to spare anymore. Now it's back to cookies. Choices of food coupon, boss. We are going to go outside. To think that our destiny is linked to goddamn car keys. Bonjour. That's great. They finally went to Paris. Bonjour à tous aussi. Damn. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. This insurance is worthless. Ouais, ça fait mal. The house looks so great. William finally had the time to paint the house mm. and fix up the garden. Que ça change. I'm sorry, Bongo Kitty, but you passed on before I changed this reality. Mm. Look at all these dead birds. It's happening here, too. Oh, 
man, the swing is gone now. It must have been sad for Chloe when William took it down. Chloe actually moved our drawing so she could see it from her room. Chloe. I'm glad Chloe gets a room with a view. Il peut pas vraiment y aller. Allons-y. Donc la marque que j'ai faite hier. It's the same graffiti from before. Et qui ne sert absolument à rien de faire une photo dessus d'ailleurs. C'est ce que je veux coupon, boss. Allez. Montons. Joyce and William never had a garage sale before. They're drowning in debt just to take care of their daughter. Such bullshit. Allez, montons. La chambre de Chloé. Attention. Chloé's door doesn't have a warning anymore. Ça change. C'est vide. Sure, this is a total coincidence. J'espère pour toi. But at least we never had to hide from step douche. I guess we stopped growing up together. Allez, vas-y, si toi. La rose s'est passée un petit peu. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. I feel so guilty for putting Chloe and her family through this. I could give Chloe the choice of keeping William alive, but that would be cruel. But then I see that they're a family again, and who am I to judge? much about William's brother. <laughs> Shoes. <laughs> Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. <laughs> Toys? I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Malheureusement, tu peux pas. They bought crutches for Chloe. Hoping she might walk again. C'est une façon de voir le verre à moitié plein, alors qu'ils auraient largement de quoi le boire à moitié vide. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. Alors ces deux portes, on sait toujours pas à quoi servent. How's it going, time tripper? Funny. I think I look older. Nothing here. The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. 
Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine, too. All about you, Arcadia Bay, isn't it? Bonne question, Max. Très bonne question. Apparently, the only thing that hasn't changed is this view. Oh, Max, it is so nice to have you around. Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. That is such a sweet shot of Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. Sans doute William. William is trying so hard. He's still awesome. Et beau mulet aussi, très beau mulet. Le premier qui dit que c'est moche à muler, je lui casse la gueule. Oh non. I didn't realize how bad Chloe's entry really was. It's good for Chloe to. Huh. Joyce used to hate smokers in the diner. Joyce is already a super mom. Mm. Bon, allez, on sort. Je suis pas sociable. Malheureusement. Allez, allons revoir Chloé. Toujours la trace de vent. They gave Chloé their giant expensive HD TV, and they use her shitty tube television. Chloe can totally control her computer. It's so great people get this high-tech help. There's the old Chloe. Me demande ce que c'était. Mais ça on pourrait pas le voir tout à l'heure. Chloe has a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. Nothing but medical supplies. On lui donner. Juste refaire un mini tour du propriétaire. C'est pas du livre. Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy and painless. Um, okay, but. Get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo, but can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please, my diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Alors, juste regarde un truc. Ok, c'est bon, je te suis où il va. Allons-y. 
So Chloe has her own photo album. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. Qu'est-ce que tu veux dire par là? Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally, seems like yesterday. I wish it was. Me too. This photo. Maybe I could. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just. Putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you. Be my last memory. You understand? Yes, I do. All you have to do is crank up the IV to eleven. Chloe, I, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but... I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once, I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please. Help me, Max. Et c'est là que tu te dis que juste cette scène, elle peut mettre en éclat une grande partie de ce que tu pensais être capable. Avant d'avoir fait cette scène, je pensais si quelqu'un me demandait de mettre fin à ces jours, je le ferais sans hésiter. Et juste ça, juste cette scène là, elle m'a fait, euh, m'a fait vraiment du mal. M'a fait vraiment du mal. Et la première fois quand j'ai, quand j'ai fait le jeu. J'ai refusé. Contrairement à tout ce que j'aurais pu penser une heure avant. Déjà parce que je m'y attendais absolument pas. Et puis... Et puis voilà. Je m'attendais absolument pas et ça m'a pris de court et... et... puis je commençais vraiment à m'attacher à Chloé. 
Ouais, c'est un choix très dur, mais bon. Bon. Donc, euh, pas de rewind. On, vous avez voté pour qu'il n'y ait pas de victime collatérale. Et Chloé en fait partie. Donc, je vais refuser. Même si c'est très dur. It wrecks me to see you in any pain, but I don't have any right to do this. I'm an adult. I'm giving you the right for Joyce and William. I already said my goodbyes to them, but they won't honor my wishes. You will, right? I, I can't kill you with an overdose. Max, I'm dying from my illness, not my dosage. This accelerates the process. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And I want my best friend to help me out. I am going to help you, but not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Why, Max? You're just bailing on me like everybody else. Why don't you go now? You've been wanting to since you got here, right? So go and don't come back. I am never leaving you again. Hey. Hey, c'est un choix vachement dur. Suis-le. Donc, ben, sur ce, ben, on va rester sur cette impression-là. On se donne rendez-vous demain pour un épisode un peu plus joyeux. En même temps, ça va être difficile de faire pire. Donc, euh, à demain. Faites gaffe à vous. Et faites gaffe à la biche. Tchuss.